Okay. Okay. Very good. Again. All right. Also, on the side of you, Peter very consistently doesn't get paid for eight month blocks. So, so you think we need more money for? Oh yeah, we need for, money to pay our staff. But that would be that would be funny if you came in there asking for money for your dad. So you yeah. Think well, I, I, I mean that's not what I was going to say. Yeah, no, I mean that's a legitimate it's thing, but everybody go, oh well, he's just thinking for his family, right? Cam, have you worked a camera before? <laughs> I, I thought Wait, not. So, how much money do we want? Do we know? Much, what is there? Uh, let's budget? ask for something reasonable. Board of director, I'm, I'm director of man. Well, no, I, that's the budget. Camera. The budget is about a hundred thousand dollars. But that's you know. You want seventy-five thousand dollars? No. Uh, yeah, no. I you're not going to get it. Let's start off something reasonable. What is Two thousand. Two thousand. All right. Five thousand. Five thousand. Yeah, Going once. Reasonable. Go once. <laughs> All right. And what does everybody think Sorry. about Molly's proposal? Ask for a five thousand dollar hit for the school that you could use for instruments, field trips, textbooks, computers. Computers. What does everybody think about that? Five thousand. That sound, everybody? Yeah? Okay, put down five thousand dollars there. Five thousand uh, dollars. Now, 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 now we're presenting this to the board. Okay, you say we want this. You want to use you want to actually spend the money on things that are gonna last like instrument. I mean field trips are fun, but right. if you spend money on that, then the money's gone. Now who are you talking to? We got to think about. Yeah. Hey, we got to think about who our audience is. The board of directors. Who's all the board of directors? Okay. Colleen. Remember yeah. Colleen? Yeah. Barb Bloomfield. Wow. Louise. I like Jack Storm. I like Mary Ellen. Joel. Mary Ellen likes us all. Pamela, and me. That's who's on the board. I like all of the boards. Now. Now, who do you, now, what do you think the board wants to hear? You know, the board is responsible for the entire farm, so you want to have to try to convince them that somehow giving money to the school is going to help the entire farm. The next generation is important, and we right. want to be well-educated. There you go, write that down. No, it is one of your reasons. Importance for the next generation. You want to help, you want to help Noah explain this? Yes. To the board? Yeah? Okay. I can. Yeah. What's that? I said I can, yeah, because I'm staying for the board meeting. You're going to come? Uh -huh. Okay, good. But anybody who wants to talk can. Sometimes no one can represent you. It doesn't mean not every rest of you can speak, too. So we want, okay, especially he needs education since so he can't spell education. Oh, I'm dyslexic. Oh, I can't <laughs> spell and I can't. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, look, I meant to put the O and I put an A. I just can't handle it. Okay, okay, okay. All right, okay. <laughs> All right. Um, this okay. isn't the actual paper we're going to be showing the... No. So, so again, again, here's your chance. You're, you're, going, you're going to a government body. All right? Zach, what do you think? What do you think about this? How are you going to convince them to give you $5,000? I have no idea, really. I suppose, like, by convincing them? Like saying, we need this, and here's why. Yeah. You, don't why. you don't want to make them feel well, guilty. There's persuasive things. Persuasive. How can we persuade? I know where you live. Strike right. what she said about the future generation. I mean, yeah. future the generation. Yeah, striking future it, striking generation. it out like, Wait, hey, Ella, your grandson goes to the school. Don't you want him to get a good education? Okay. <laughs> You're trying to make it personal then. No. Right? He'll trip him. No? Well, yeah, all right. What about the board cares about the entire farm? Someone said, what about the next generation and all that? What about if, how about this? If the school was better equipped, had more textbooks, musical instruments, we would attract more people here who could actually help the farm out. It's good for kids. the economy. It's good for the farm's economy. Good for the farm's economy. I'll, I'll write this down for you, okay? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Education for current and next generation farm economy. We can take this. We can take this to. Or you can take this to the board meeting. <coughs> okay. 
Okay? We would start off with, we, need, we came here to ask for money for the school. Molly, you want to try this? Along with Noah? What? I mean, you could, you know, we could have this, you could present one yes. year for it. And then you're looking for $5,000, education, it's good for the foreign economy. Yes. What other, what other reasons would you say, would you argue? Um, what was the question? That we can attract people to continue the farm as a community. We could do what? Attract young families. Attract young families. Also, attract people just to see the school, and if they think that it's a worthy cause, people are more likely to donate time and money. Um, and if the and send their kids. Right. Yeah. So and attract school, people. What else? What? What else did you say? What was the? You first said thing? people to come see the school and donate money to it. Okay. And, and send their kids to. It. So money attracts and money, feet, right? Well. well yeah. Although that's not a, I mean, Perry. they could spend it anyway, and it would. We could spread it on um, violence and the We get no, not violence. You can spend it on a couch. <laughs> the more s students that are at the farm school, the, the farther our good vibes go out to the world. Well, imagine if every high school student had this for a civics class. <laughs> like, imagine if every high school student went. Imagine if every high school student. At a civics class. Pretty, or this civics class. class. Yeah. yeah. This for a civics class. Right. Okay. Alicia, what do you think? Do you care? No. <laughs> you don't care. You're just fine being here. Yeah. You don't care if there was no money at all for the farm school. Wait a year. Oh, yeah. yeah. It'd be cool if there more money. Okay. What would you use the money for? Money. What? A maid. <laughs> a maid. Okay, do you all have to I clean? I think they call them janitors. Do you have to clean the yes. 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 Cleaning yes. staff. I like not having a maid because it makes us clean up after yeah. ourselves. Yeah, it gives you guys, it teaches you guys responsibility. Yeah, but we can't. Yeah. I'm here and I'm clean. Okay. I think if you You're went. You're paying to learn how to be I mean, responsible. I think if you went to the board and you yes, told. Yes, you are paying to learn hey, how to clean. I think if you went to the board and you told them you wanted a maid. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Clunk. yeah, I don't. I don't think "made" the right word. I think yeah. like we would like to have enough money. We would like a custodian to, to like employ to, a, f a farm member. I would like to hire oh. more teachers so we could learn more subjects. Yeah, yeah. and not waste time cleaning. No yeah, janitor. I don't think. Okay. Yeah. I don't the think. The Bruna doesn't want a janitor. I don't either. I'm not a yeah, you yeah, leave all your stuff around so other people have to clean it up. No. First, you don't want to do it right here. No, I don't want a janitor to get It's closed. She wants to look okay. I just don't think the board's going to go for, oh, let's hire a janitor. Yeah. Go okay, it. okay. So, but we did have the other stuff. And we said it's good for the farm economy. There's a way we do it Money attracts money. What other reasons? We, you know, we said what we want to spend it on, musical instruments, field trips. I think like you said, if the school is more equipped and has more stuff going on, more classes, more studies, then it's going to attract people. Attract people. Attract, yeah. people. attract rabbits. Yeah, attract we'll attract more rabbits. rabbits to the farm school. Is that good? Right. Any other reason? Can anybody have any other reason think why? Which one? I said Cookie likes this idea. He helped out with his I think Cookie has skull, yes. Peter can get paid. <laughs> okay. That's a worthy All right, I'm, 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 uh, okay. We're at the, let's just do a little practice run, okay? Okay. I'm board of directors. I'm one of the board, okay? All right, I'm going to sit here, and let's say Molly and Noah, you go up there, and you present to me. You, you, you uh, you use, the, you can use that. We'll bring this in, and you explain what you're going to do. Go ahead. You guys get up there. Here's a little magic marker if you need it. I'm going to sit here. I'm one of the board of directors. Okay. I'm... Okay, uh, what are you all doing here? Shouldn't you be in bed by now? Uh, shouldn't you be... No, isn't this past your bedtime? Weren't you hitchhiking across the country when you were my age? <laughs> No. Now, what you, what's, the, what's the school doing here? This is a board of directors meeting. Well, we are here to 
make a request of the farm to support the farm school. Okay, you got to be more serious. <laughs> if I think you're joking with me, I'm not going to take you seriously. Yeah, don't wear that shirt. <laughs> All right. There's We'd a... like to present an argument for why the board should donate $5,000 of its $100,000 budget to the farm school to support the next generation. Okay, and what, how come? Why, why, why would... Why should we do that? Education is important. Um, the better education we have here, the more of an impact we can make on the world at large. We can spread peace and good hippie vibes around the world. Okay. Um, and more people will listen to you if you're articulate and if you know what you're talking about. <laughs> and how's, how's five to... You guys seem to be doing pretty good at the school already. I'm on, on the board here. Yeah. What What's five thousand dollars going to do? Why should we, we We need five thousand dollars to fix the roads and you know do all sorts of important stuff. Why should we give money to the school? All sorts of important. Well, how's How's that going to help? I mean, you guys seem to be doing okay without that money. Well, I think. Sorry. We could enrich the farm economy by hiring more teachers and. Uh, Eventually, that that money would uh, somewhat make its way back to the uh, people of the farm. Well, five thousand dollars isn't going to hire a teacher, right? Yeah, at the farm school. We can get five teachers for that. The more education you put into the kids when they grow up, there's going to yeah. be better ideas for the farm. I mean, if you don't, yeah. you know. Okay. I want some of you. Some of you all. We're at the board of directors right now. You can, if if you see Noah or Molly. You want to add something in? Feel free to do that. Okay. Okay. So do you say education is more important than fixing the road? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So the, the farm school is a central point of the community. Okay. How's that? How's it a central point? Um, I mean, families send their students here, send their children here. Yeah. Um, I mean, we spend a lot of our time here, and we're the youth of the farm. Right. Okay. If so children are the future, the school is the future of the farm. Put that down. Future of the farm. Does everybody like that? Yeah. Karuna, one day, could be on the board of directors. <coughs> or Christina. If we give money and we hire more teachers, some of the people might be able to fix the roads for really cheap. There you go. Who, how, I don't say we hire more teachers. Hire how more could, teachers. How could they then fix the roads for cheaper? We can hire well, your teachers to teach us how to fix roads. Yes. <laughs> okay. Now, you don't go to school to learn how to fix roads. Those are the people that don't go to school that go to the fix roads. <laughs> okay. Okay, future of the farm. All right. Okay, so I think I'm seeing um, why why this would be a good idea. Now, what, what would you use this money for? Yeah. Are you guys going to wheel that? Yeah, I'll bring it. I'll bring it over here for you. Um, computers. Computers. Well, you. I heard you have like five or six computers. Yes, but our computers have all been donated. They're from like the seventies. And you um, have more than five or six oh, computers. Okay. Yeah. Hold on a Hold on. They weren't that small in the seventies. Um. So you have you, you have seven computers from the seventies? Um. Well, that that's sort of unrealistic. No. We do have we have um. Computers that have less brain power than your standard calculator. Really? Yes. yes. Do you have, so we show our computers. So do you need? You could use some more computers. Yes, we could use better quality computers. Okay. How about what you say? Textbooks over there. What kind of textbooks would you get? Um. Well, we have the same textbooks that all of your children used when they were in high school and farm school. Okay. So uh, is it like? <laughs> so is it outdated? Yes, yeah, very you, outdated. You're yes. learning how to fix like horse and buggies. And stuff. Nixon is no, still the president. We're, we're ta I mean, like our geography textbooks still have. We're still learning about how big the USSR is. Yes. Okay. Seriously. I want. I want. I want Zach. I want you and uh, Elizabeth and Christina and Karina to help these guys out. I'm. I'm. I keep asking questions. Where should we go? If we get shifting away. What's that? You'll look more confident if you stop sitting your late, late weight. Oh, I, was, like, I thought I was doing like a confident gangster. No. No. It's it's oh, okay, this is good. <laughs> okay, we're talking about pre presentation. And, and Noah, 
you're involved in one of you needs to go to the board and do the stuff and flip the pages because if both of you go to do it, it looks unprofessional. Right. I think mean, really your attitude and demeanor is more important than what you're wearing, truthfully. Well, both. Okay. And yeah. Both, both. Yeah. Computers, they're fucking. Um, positive, that's positive. good. Right. Okay. What do you think positive is better than complaining when you're trying to talk to a government? Because government it shows government. that we'll be thankful What's for that? what we have. It shows that we're already thankful for what we have, so we're going to appreciate whatever makes okay. that even better. And you think that's more persuasive? Yes. Yeah? yeah? You think people would rather re reward somebody who's positive than. Yeah, nobody wants to hear anybody complaining. Like when I hear people complaining, I just kind of zone them out. Unless um, it's about something important that like okay. they actually should complain. Like you know the farm school. So, <laughs> <laughs> how about okay? You, I see you put a scholarship program there. Can you explain that? Why would that why would that be helpful? Well, we are one of the least expensive private schools in the country. The least expensive. The least expensive. But um, we still, the, uh, the economy of the farm is not as, overall, is not as uh, good as it could be. We're poor. And, um, <laughs> All right. and um, there's, some there's some people on the farm who are you know, ra starting to raise their families who went to the farm schools themselves who can simply not afford to send their kids to the farm school. Okay. And um, the scholarship program would uh, help us provide some aid to uh, to those families, so they could really stay fully part of the community, as opposed to I mean, as opposed to sending their kids to a you know a learning uh, prison. Okay. Now let me let me I want to give you a suggestion when you're talking tonight. Anytime you speak, look directly at people in the eye. If you like, I would like five thousand dollars from you. To see. <laughs> Scratch my armpit. I like to in the eye. Yeah. That that's that will work. Okay. Or gaze at your navel. You know? Okay. Also, also become you know kind of dressed nice or or not not you know not really. Really fancy, but you know. <laughs> you Don't worry about cooking. Okay. No, Christine, Christina, do you think you can help them out? Wear your farm school t shirts. Oh, my God. Do you think you can help them out at all? Do not ask yes. Well, that's the only way I want to do it. Like, for what you would say about the text book thing, because I Okay. Okay. Based on what Karuna told me, I'm taking five thousand dollars from the school. No, I'm just kidding. No, you gotta be careful. You can't be too funny or glib. I mean. Okay, that's okay. You do, I was sat in the dog committee with you. You did really good. You were very good at when you're passionate about something. You can or you, you're very good. You you can argue your point. <laughs> Why would musical instruments? Excuse me, I say musical instruments. We're going to buy you guys musical instruments. Well, Why, you should be studying. The musical education has been proven to raise people's self-esteem. Oh, okay. All right. Also, many many great bands have come out of the farm school. That's true. Strut. That's right. Strut. All right. THB. PHP, wow. Okay. Token Nation. <laughs> All right. That is right. All right, so after you make your presentation, people ask you questions. What you want to do is make a final summation. You want to say something that kind of puts it all together and moves people to, to you know, do what you want them to do. Okay? So what's that going to be? What would you say? Um, First of all, in closing, in we closing. would like five thousand dollars <laughs> to further the community educationally. You also want to. You don't want to. You don't want to. You never want to forget to thank people for listening to you.
Thank you for giving me the time to make this presentation. Okay, that's important too. So you let them know that you didn't just think you were going to come in here and waste your time, but you, you knew their time was valuable. Okay? Or we could go for the whole sympathy thing, where, you know, you know what comes in with messed up hair and, like, like Oh, and you can be wearing, like, clothes, a, a potato know, sack. A potato <laughs> sack. I don't, I don't think that will go over. <laughs> and paper it bag might go over shoes. for laughs. You might get some good laughs. Paper bag and shoes. sometimes that's okay. Sometimes you can be comical. But, um, okay, who's going to who's going to come there? Who's going to be there at eight o'clock tonight? I have no idea. Okay. Oh, you, yeah. It'd be nice if you came. I don't know. Okay. I don't. I'm not sure. Can I'm you make it? Where our schedule is. Maybe. Okay. All right. All right. Well, if you if you, if you come and I'll bring this for you. You want to use this? Um, your presentation? I'd like to rewrite it. Yes. You want to rewrite it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, I'll tell you what, I'll leave it with you when you bring it. Okay. Okay? And you can use this. Okay, I'm not going to see you all the next week. You've got your assignment, which is your test. Turn it in two weeks. I want you to do petitions, and I want you to read Animal Farm. Okay? That's it for today's class. Thank you.